leading cancer expert, treats prostate cancer non-invasively. He was the first in New York with fractionated brain radiosurgery, and he's the first in America and in the Western Hemisphere with body radiosurgery. You can also call Dr. Lederman at 212 Choices for a free informative booklet and DVD. Hey, Dr. Lederman, we're back. Hey, we're back. If you have questions, call us, 800-321-0710. 800-321-0710. Uh, John was telling you about patients from around the world. So one of the patients around the world that he saw this week was a gentleman, an architect, who came to us from Italy. A year and a half ago, he had pancreas diagnosed. He actually, more than 10 years ago, came to us for prostate cancer treatment. He was treated by us with the program we described in the stereotactic frame and brachytherapy. He's cancer-free, and he's still cancer-free from the prostate, and he's sexually functional, and he has a girlfriend in Italy who's 32 years old, and he brought in the pictures of his girlfriend. He's about 70, so it gives you a pretty good idea how our prostate cancer program works and the quality of life. He, a year and a half ago, was diagnosed, however, with pancreas cancer, so totally different cancer. Pancreas is an organ near the stomach. It produces uh, hormones. It's one of those cancers that's not very much talked about because it's uh, from an organ that's deep in the body. In Italy, they worked him up, and they were going to remove his pancreas. He wanted to come for a second opinion with us. He knows what a second opinion is. He came, we staged him up, and actually we found that the cancer had traveled to a lymph node. So it was one of those uh, lymph nodes that was missed in Italy. We treated both the pancreas and the lymph node with five radiosurgery treatments. He was in total remission. He got a new PET scan about a month ago in Italy. He was told everything's A-OK. -okay. We had it reviewed, again, another fresh second opinion, actually found a different spot of cancer in the mesentery, totally different. He had had chemo in, in Italy, and obviously the chemo didn't work. He was told in Italy that PET scan was negative. We had it reviewed. It showed a spread to the mesentery. We repeated the PET scan three weeks later, which was this past week. It showed that that nodule had grown, consistent with a metastasis. It was the only spot. He chose to have it treated with radiosurgery. He had five treatments. They were all non-invasive, painless. He had his five treatments. He's going home. Actually went home yesterday, Saturday, to be with his family, his loved one, his 32-year-old girlfriend. He's doing well. He had no side effects. He's fully functional. He is thinking about other treatment, but prefers radiosurgery, which has served him well has good quality of life, continues to work, continues to have a social life, continues to have a private life, and is doing A-OK. -okay. Actually, doing very well. But another woman who came with breast cancer, a young woman about 30, we send patients to what we think are the best radiology centers because there's all kinds of radiology centers. Some seem to do the right thing and some seem to do other things. We like the ones that do the right thing almost always. Uh, our group got a PET scan on this woman, and they put a little contrast in, and they actually evaluated her head, which most centers don't do. They found tumors in her head by PET scan. Usually a PET scan doesn't include the brain. So our center has included the brain. They diagnosed actually early before she had any symptoms that the tumor had spread to the brain. We had never treated her before. She's getting her treatment elsewhere. She just came for a second opinion with us. She's been getting second opinions with us since January. You don't have to get treatment with us to get a second opinion with us. So ding, ding, ding. You may think about that. Put that in your head and percolate a little bit. You don't have to get a treatment with us to get a second opinion. Maybe we can give you some new ideas. Well, she got new ideas. She was found to have this brain tumor before it caused harm. Usually for cancer patients, doctors wait until it causes harm to diagnose it. Well, we don't want that. You don't want to have a stroke or seizures or calamity. So she was diagnosed. We got an MRI to confirm that. We started treatment. She's going to have just a few treatments at Radio City New York. She's doing great. She's coming in, and I just want to tell you about her case. So, again, she's a young woman. We wish her the best and to continue in a very, 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 very good way. Uh, we're located at 38th and Broadway. Our name is Radio Surgeon New York. My name is Dr. Gil Lederman. We think we're not only 
super convenient, but we're pretty super. We answer your calls. We send you information. We have a booklet DVD. We promise to have an appointment for you within one business day, even if that means that we work harder uh, because we know and respect the patient. And we know if you're sitting home and are nervous, you got a lump in your breast or an elevated PSA or something's wrong with your urine or your cancer treatment just isn't working for you or if it isn't tolerated for you, we know you probably want to get a second opinion. And we think that waiting and sitting at home putrefying is not the best way to be. So we try to do the right thing, and that's why we promise within one business day to see you at our office, which is 1384 Broadway, 1384 Broadway. And as you just heard from John, it's very close to Macy's. We're at 38th and Broadway, right between Macy's and Times Square on Broadway. We have a spacious, modern cancer treatment center. It's a private center, which means we don't take money from drug companies, so you won't see us pushing drug down your throat. We'll talk about chemo. If it's the best thing for you, great, we'll talk about it, but we won't be pushing it down your throat or giving you studies that have never been tried in human beings before or have no data. You're going to get the best possible treatment that you can get, non-invasive, most probably, and that means a private center that works for you, where you're the boss, not the pharmaceutical companies that give tens of million dollars to a hospital or to a facility to possibly twist their opinion. When you come to a private center like ours, we know who you are, you know who we are. There's no miles of cold corridors or locked doors or strange faces except most insurances, Medicare, Medicaid. So if you have insurances, Medicare, Medicaid, we usually accept all those. You can call us day or night. You can speak directly to the doctor, not to machines, not to students. If you don't have machines answering the phone, you can call and speak to the doctor. So isn't that the way you'd want to be treated? You can call and speak to the doctor. You don't have machines. The place works for you, not the drug companies. Sounds pretty good. That's how I'd want to be if I were a patient. That's how I'd want to be if I was the doctor. So Radio Surgery in New York, we have a booklet DVD. Our phone number is 212-CHOICES, 212-246-4237. 212-246-4237. We had a gentleman come in this week who was born in India. He's actually a Sikh um, religion, so he has that uh, respect of the hair and the turban. Came with his brother. He has sigmoid cancer. It's metastatic to the liver and to the lung. He's been getting chemotherapy elsewhere. He's had a variety of symptoms. He sought out opinions about stereotactic radiosurgery because he wants a better chance to control his cancer, better than the chemo that he's getting for his adenocarcinoma of the sigmoid, stage 4, with lung and liver metastasis. We spoke about all the options. We spoke about the risks and benefits. We spoke about his cancer marker, which was elevated. He had a CEA cancer marker. Uh, he had some weakness and difficulty from the chemo. He lost a lot of pounds. He went from 170 down to 120 pounds over these two years, so it's been poorly tolerated uh, treatment there. Uh, we started with stereotactic body radiosurgery to hit the cancer in the lung, to hit the cancer in the liver. We've treated about 20,000 patients with stereotactic radiosurgery. We were the first in America and the first in Western Hemisphere with this technology. Obviously, we wish this gentleman well, and he's doing well on our treatment. There's a news article that was just published that shows that women who have lumpectomy and save their breast have a better cancer-specific survival in early breast cancer than women who choose mastectomy. This was a large retrospective study that looked at 5- and 10-year survival. There was about an 11% improvement compared to mastectomy. So for women who falsely think that mastectomy is a better treatment, no, you don't have to lose your breast. Actually, controlling for certain differences among patient groups, women who save their breast overall had a 30% improvement in survival compared to mastectomy alone. So it's new information. Uh, you can do better by saving your breast and saving your life. 
Give us a call if you have a question at 212 Choices. 212 Choices. Um, we had another woman who came in with fallopian tube cancer. She'd been getting chemotherapy, 18 different types of chemotherapy. She works, she's more than 70 years old. She works in a law office in New York. <clears throat> she's been doing very well. She's dissatisfied, justifiably, with her chemotherapy. She heard about us. All the cancer's in one spot. She started radio surgery and is doing great. We'll speak more about her. If you have questions, just give us a call at 212 Choices. 212 Choices. Thank you for tuning in. Have a great week, and God bless you. Thanks for tuning in to the Radio Surgery Hour with Dr. Gil Lederman and myself. If you have questions before next week's show or want a free informative booklet and DVD, just contact Dr. Lederman at 212 Choices. That's 212-246-4237. That's 212-246-4237. Till next week. Here's Dr. Gil Lederman, New York's only Harvard-trained, triple-board-certified radiation cancer doctor. If chemo, surgery, or radiation isn't working or isn't tolerated when cancer and its pain and symptoms aren't getting better, seek a fresh second opinion at Radio Surgery New York's Urgent Cancer Consultants for innovative, custom-tailored cancer treatment. See our experts within one business day because we know your time and your life are precious. Our goal is proper diagnosis and effective, non-invasive outpatient treatment. Decades of leadership, first in New York with brain radiosurgery, first in America with body radiosurgery for cancers of the brain, body, and prostate, all custom-tailored for you. Call 212-CHOICES, 212-CHOICES for a prompt appointment and free booklet DVD. Super convenient, 38th and Broadway, with most insurances, Medicare, Medicaid accepted. You're next at Radio Surgery New York. Just call 212 Choices. 212 Choices. 212 Choices. 212 Choices. 212 Choices. 212 Choices. 212 Choices.